it's Alex here from WPEagle.com. In this video, we're gonna be talking about security. So you might have heard that WordPress can have some security issues. And the reason for this is that WordPress is really popular. And by being popular, that means that you become a target for hackers because obviously you might as well target something that's really popular because you've got a good chance of finding lots of websites that run WordPress and you're you know, able to hack into them. However, it's nothing to worry about. Uh, I'm gonna take you through a few of my top tips in terms of keeping WordPress secure. And uh, well, let's do them now. Okay, my first tip is you must keep WordPress up to date. Uh, now this is easily done if you go into the updates area within WordPress and you'll be able to see all the plugins that need updating and all uh, any other updates that are available in terms of themes and the WordPress core. It's critically important that you do keep your website up to date um, because generally these updates um, give you fixes for security problems and such like. One word of warning, when you are updating, sometimes things can go wrong. So it's a good idea to make sure that your website is backed up before you carry out these updates, just in case something does go wrong, and then you can easily roll back and kind of work out whether it was a plugin or something that's caused the problem. When it comes to updating your theme, this can be a little bit more tricky because a lot of themes don't offer an automatic update feature. So I suggest you check with whoever you got your theme in terms of how they recommend you, you update. Now, the next three tips are all about plugins uh, because that's one of the easiest ways to uh, add some extra security features to your website. And the first plugin I want to talk about is by a company called Securi and they offer security services, but they also offer a great free plugin, which basically scans your site, keeps an eye on it, makes sure that uh, there's nothing dodgy going on, and also sends you some great email alerts when people are maybe trying to log into your website or carry out a brute force attack and all sorts of things like that. It also has got some features where you can harden certain security uh, features in terms of your upload directory and some other bits and bobs, which are quite important to do as well. Uh, and it can all be done very easily with the click of a button. My next plugin is a very simple plugin. It's called Limit Logins. And as it suggests, it limits the number of logins that people can attempt. Uh, so this again is great to prevent people trying to guess passwords because you can set it say after three times to prevent them trying to log in again. So a very quick and simple plugin, just uh, install it from the WordPress plugin install area and uh, activate it and off you go. And your site is already getting more secure. The last plugin I want to suggest is a plugin called Clef. Um, now this plugin eliminates username and passwords altogether and allows you to log in using your smartphone, uh, which is really great. So that, yeah, again, eliminates any problems with people trying to hack passwords and usernames and all that kind of stuff because you simply use your mobile phone to log in. So again, yeah, highly recommended and a great way to uh, harden up the security on your WordPress website. So that concludes this video. It's only a little short one. Um, obviously there are a number of other security plugins out there if you wanna go and check them out. But you know, if you put these on your website, you'll be pretty secure as it is and probably don't have to worry too much more. I hope you found this video useful. Uh, if you've got any questions or comments about WordPress security, anything like that, please leave them below. If you like what I'm doing, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And I'll see you soon. Stay safe.